Hey Blab Dads, you can see we are driving in the car or van right now and we're at the um, furthest point from the entrance to St. George Island State Park. And um, yeah, so on one side, this side right over here is the golf side, which you can't really see. I'm going to turn it in a second. And on this side is the golf side. Uh, so let me turn. So to your right, past these dunes is the golf, is the... Uh, um, the bay side and where these cars are right over here is the golf side so you can see right here there's one two three four five probably six or seven spaces along with a handicap space and that's all that they have for these side ones but um, as we drive here it is just pristine look at the beautiful dunes on each side now I doubt that these dunes were made on the right hand side uh, naturally probably to dig up the road uh, they have to dig up the dirt and then put it to one side which I believe is on that side to the right and then these are the natural dunes probably more natural over here on the left hand side um, so let me turn from the road to this area right over here okay so you may see in the distance blue not only the sky, but the aquamarine waters um, of the Gulf. It's a very, very beautiful sight. We just got there from the last video. So um, it is one of the precious commodities here in Florida to have um, our state parks. Uh, and with those state parks, they have beaches to to celebrate and uh, I'm going to turn towards my family here while we're uh, driving the four miles to get back to the uh, the entrance way so let me turn that around for us here all right now as we're in the car where's my first daughter Is she over there hi first daughter did you have fun today yeah, yeah had a lot of fun I'm tired. you tired yeah. now here is something to note. Very, very hot today. It is still summer. Sun is blazing. So you think being in that 82 degree water is going to cool you off, right? Well, the sun saps you of your energy. And um, the winds and the waves uh, make you tired. Make you lethargic. So if you're not drinking water on a normal basis, guess what? You're going to get dehydrated. And uh, unfortunately, we didn't have any, not just water, but cold, ice cool water. We didn't have any of that. So um, all of us are very, very thirsty right now. So what we need to get is water um, to help hydrate ourselves. So we're going to be coming up in about a mile to where we actually uh, parked at. So you're going to see from long distance the, I would say the middle section uh, of this island uh, where we camped out um, on the beach and had some fun. So let me turn it around. So as you can see in the distance over there in the middle of your screen, you've got these odd shaped um, structures which really is just the roof of a pavilion. So there's two pavilions over there to the uh, to the left of this house-looking structure in the middle, and those were the were the bathrooms and the changing rooms. It wasn't that crowded at noon. Normally, when I go anywhere, it's usually in the morning. So we beat the crowds, but there really wasn't a crowd when we pulled up. Um, probably 20 cars, maybe, in the parking lot. Now this is getting out of view, sorry about that. So I'll pull in one more time. So this is called the East Slough Beach Area. East Slough. And there's trails here on this island. I don't know why you, you would take a walk on a trail at this um, uh, this hot of a day. Some people do that. 
So here's the parking lot. It's not full now, and it wasn't really full. Even with this construction that we had over here, it wasn't full at all. Those people that are uh, going up the ramp right there, those are the changing rooms and the bathroom. If you look over here, underneath this building, those are picnic tables. And beyond it right there are showers to the right, right where those flags are. And then here's one of the three pavilions. And there's the view. Look at that view, folks. Beautiful. All right. So, Blab Dads, what do you think? Saint, not Saint, I'm sorry. Dr. Julian Bryce, St. George Island State Park. If you've ever been here before and you know the deal, go ahead and like down below, comment if you've ever been here before in this area. Um, we are just east of Apalachicola, which is the next large town over. Don't forget to subscribe down below as well as hit that bell. Ding! Alright, so we will see you in the next video. Alright, bye-bye from Blood Dad's Van.